Hi, y'all. Welcome. Welcome, my friends. Welcome today to the neighborhood where we have my man, Ren. Y'all know that I have, over this year, since July when I started this channel, I have become a big Ren fan. And I, <laughs> it's almost like I have to apologize to myself and to Ren because what, when I very first heard him, I didn't see it. I didn't see what all the hoopla was about. But, uh, you know, sometimes when you're introduced to a new genre of music, someone who is doing something fresh, you have to learn how to hear it. You know what I mean? Um, because I had already done that with some of the other music um, over the previous year that I had different genres that I had never listened to before that were actually fairly new genres. And I developed an ear for them. And I, 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 I felt it. And that is what has happened with me. Uh, this man is an artist. So that's why I get a big kick out of videos like this, because I have seen the theatrical side of Ren. I have seen the deep workings of his mind and the way his pen, I mean, his pen is flawless, right? Um, so when he's doing these covers, he's always so joyful and spirited and you know he he brings his own essence to it which I love that that is what I'm looking for in an artist and a lot of times I like it better I mean yeah a lot of times I do so this is this is uh this is gonna be very interesting for me to see his cover of uh the these Nirvana songs some of us were you know it was new <laughs> Now it's classic music. That's so weird. But um, yeah, hang around and we're going to get started with this. All right. Once again, I'm jealous of all the people out here <laughs> getting to hear him. See what I mean? He held enough of the song's original structure that you know exactly what it is. And if you're really familiar with the Nirvana song, you know where it's supposed to go next, right? But he takes it and he personalizes it. He puts a little bit of that Ren magic dust that he sprinkles on everything. <laughs> That's his, his little magic seasoning. And I love that. I'm, I, I know I keep saying it, but guys, I'm so jealous. I'm so jealous of these people who don't know the greatness that they are <laughs> around right here. And it looks like my internet might be lagging just a little bit, maybe because of the weather. The 
lady in the back there knows the song. <laughs> him again <laughs> look at him <laughs> oh he's a cool boy. they started telling him where they yelled nice voice you know I, I often wonder it's like what what would it be like to be a busker like that you know someone who's trying to make it and you don't know like especially with him when he was dealing with his sickness he just had to stick it out right because he didn't know that he was going to make it he didn't know that one day he was going to have the number one song in the UK. He didn't know that. And watch out America, because I can tell you this. I started seeing him, um, probably maybe it was 2022. Um, reactors that I was watching were reacting to him. It might have been early, early 2023, but there were people that I watched and that's how I first heard of him and of course they saw something I guess more than what I saw because they were they loved it like they were flipping out and I was like it was good it was okay but I don't really get it um I'm so glad that I kept with it because I so much enjoy Ren's artwork and his the, the thing that really draws me to him too is his story. I love it when people have a story. Not that I want people to go through stuff because honestly, everybody goes through stuff. But when someone can be so open about it and because I can't tell you how many people have contacted just me and have said, look, he has changed my life. He has no idea the amount of strength that I've gotten from his music. I get it because that's what was happening to me with some other artists and then with Ren himself and yeah <laughs> so anyway it is a joy and an honor for me to react to Ren on this channel and um, meeting his fans has also been wonderful because I mean what a group of people <laughs> what a group and uh, the cool thing is that we are from all over we're all different ages and I love that because, you know, music can be something that brings people together. And I feel like someone who is so good with their pen and its experiences that we all understand, you know, um, most of us. <laughs> so anyway, until next time, y'all, um, stay safe. I'll try and stay warm. It's really cold and snow here. And until the next song, y'all, um, yeah, please like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. It really does help. <laughs>